This series is shipped in CKD form. This tutorial takes the Z50P installation steps as guide. Landing gear installation. Step 1. Open the package, take out the drone frames, landing gear, and fittings. Step 2. Remove the front, rear, upper, and lower covers. Turn over the frame. Step 3. Insert the four holders into both ends of the landing gear tube and install them into the frame body. Note that the arrow points to the nose of the aircraft and fasten them by screws. Step 4. According to the positioning marks, install the four T's. Note that the T-holes are horizontally facing inward. Step 5. Insert the front crossbar F and the rear crossbar B into the T-fittings. Fasten with screws. Step 6. Restore the receiver antenna. Remove the tape. Put antenna cable into slots. Fasten with screws. After the antenna is installed, turn over the body. Press the frame to level the drop. Tighten the mounting seat of the landing gear. Arm and model installation. Step 1. Pay attention to each arm label and model code. Clockwise from the head is M1 to M4 in turn. Install CCW at M1 and M3 and install CW at M2 and M4. Step 2. To install the models, first take out the screws of the protective cover, flip it over and remove the protective cover, then insert it into the arm tube. The arm label corresponds to the model number. The M1 and M2 arms only with the model cables, but the M3 and M4 arms will through the water pipe and the nozzle adapter cable first, and then thread it into the model cables, and then lightly lock them to avoid fouling up. Step 3. Install the gasket into the arm and into the frame. Note that arm and the model must be matched. When installing the rear arm, the water pipe needs to be placed at the back, and then insert it into the cables, and tighten the screws. Please glue the bottom nuts to prevent loosening. Step 4. Install the locking buckle. Insert the long pin into the hole of the arm holder. Insert the hexagonal stud into the long pin, and tighten it with the hexagonal sleeve. Insert the shock pin into the hole of the handle, and adjust the handle with suitable angle. Use the screw insert into the hex stud and tighten. Cable installation. Step 1. Arrange the cables, pass them through the rubber protective ring in turn, and then insert the protective ring to arm. Step 2. Pass all the cables through the buckle. Make sure the rubber coil is aligned with the buckle, and the bucket is aligned with the folder, and tighten. Then adjust the rubber coil and the cables to ensure they are not bent. Step 3. Please refer this picture to connect each cables. Apply grease to the signal plugs, and the plug cannot be screwed. If it cannot be inserted, please check whether the pin is bent. When installing the front cables, note the left power adapter cable is connected to the right model cable, and the right power adapter cable is connected to the left model cable. Camera installation. Step 1. Use screws to install the adapter on the camera and use half thread screws and lock nuts to install it on the front body. Step 2. Pass the camera harness through the seal at the bottom and insert the plug into the front circuit board. Then restore the seal. Nozzle installation. The nozzle is installed under the two rear model of M3 and M4. Step 1. Remove the power module of the centrifugal nozzle. Insert the nozzle cable into the nozzle adapter bracket. The notch faces outward. The lock adapter bracket. Step 2. Insert the nozzle wire into the model terminal. Then restart the nozzle. Step 3. Insert the water tubing into the model pneumatic connector. Spray tank installation. Step 1. Unlock the buckle of the water pipe at the bottom of the tank. Put the tank into the frame and lock the buckle. Step 2. Connect the two water hoses from the rear arms to the tank pipe adapter. Step 3. Connect the main control cable to the multi-function transport cable on the drone body. Finally, restore the covers to complete the Z50P assembly.